So I want you to take a minute and ask yourself, do you really appreciate what you have? And initially you might think, yeah, I do. I do appreciate what I have. The person that I'm with, they do nice things for me. They buy me things, they drive me places. Of course I appreciate what I have. But do you actually appreciate the things that don't cost money? Do you even know what these things are? Do you appreciate the things that are like being faithful, being courteous, being open with their feelings, being able to handle situations calmly, being somebody that you can trust, somebody that can always make you smile, somebody that you can tell anything to someone that always knows the right thing to say and it's crazy to me because a lot of people they don't understand what they have until it's gone there's an R&B singer by the name of Craig David and he has a song that has a lyric in it that stuck with me you don't miss the water till the well runs dry like damn man have you ever been in a really good relationship and you just let it slip like you see all these good qualities after it's too late like if you know you have a good woman or a good man you should be thanking them every single day just for letting you love them like how good does it make your soul feel knowing that this person is yours. I just beg, do not get comfortable. I see these guys out here, they're like, man, I got this. I ain't gotta try no more. Like, they know what's good, man. Trust me, we're good. And then just one day, it's done. It's just gone. You should always be pushing yourself to get better. Always. Because as soon as you start to settle, things start to change. Like if you're standing on the top of quicksand, for example, you might think everything is fine, man. Like you're good. Like there's no problems. But if you start to settle, you start sinking. And eventually you're gonna be up to your neck and you're gonna ask yourself, man, how did I get here? It's because you weren't moving. Like, come on, man. Develop yourself. Get creative. Take care of your body. Reinvent yourself. Get out of your comfort zone. Like every morning that you wake up should be a new reason for your significant other to love you all over again. That's the kind of development I'm talking about. Because guess what? If you start sinking, somebody else is coming. But they might not just be coming by. No, they're moonwalking by. They're gliding by you. And you're just there helpless, up to your neck. Don't ever make the mistake of thinking that you've just been with somebody long enough. Long enough? What does that even mean? Last time I checked, there's no loyalty reward points in a relationship. I've seen people together for over 10 years and relationships will just end. I'm just saying, don't get caught sinking. Let's go. Like you always hear these people saying, be a boss, date a boss, build an empire. Yet you're acting like an employee once you walk in the door? Just be real with yourself. Would you work for you knowing what you bring to the table? If the answer isn't yes right away, then you got some work to do. And no, this is not coming from somebody that thinks that they are perfect. This is coming from somebody that is consciously aware that I'm not perfect. Consciously aware that I should always be building, always be progressing, always be reinventing myself all the time. And it's not just for relationships either. This goes for anything. For someone who's a musician, for someone who's into sports, for somebody that's trying to get a promotion and a job. Always be reinventing yourself. So let me ask you this one more time. Do you appreciate what you have? Is your answer still the same? If this video got you fired up, go call up your significant other right now and just tell them that you love them. Right now. I really hope this got through to some of you guys that are just floating along and you don't understand why things are just starting to change. Instead of blaming somebody else on why things aren't working, start looking at yourself. Start making those changes that you have to make and maybe it can be you that's gliding. Just become consciously aware and start making those changes that you have to make. If you did find this video useful, please share this with everybody. Everybody needs to hear this. Also, please leave a like and if you did enjoy the video, please leave a comment in the comment section below. And until next time, I will see you later. Peace. Fast forward to 2016, what do we do? If something is broken, we just get a new one. Oftentimes, the thing doesn't even have to be broken and we'll still get a new one. The demographic has changed. Nowadays,